Oh, hello there, my lovely legionnaires. Ah! Hi, legionnaires. Tech support happened. I was having tech problems again! And then I summoned Justin, and he just fixed it by looking at it. So I cry. Because he, ju he just fixed it! It wasn't working, and then I call and then I cried, and Justin was like, what's the matter? And I was like, it's not working. And Justin's like, have you considered being better? And I'm like, yeah. And he's like, hit the button again. And I'm like, okay. Cause like, okay, so it was telling me failed to connect to server. And so I was like, why the fuck is it failing to connect to server? And the first thing I thought was, oh, it's gotta be the stream key. So I get a new stream key, and it's still not working, and I don't know what's wrong, so I cry, and I'm Justin! Justin! The profound eldritch wailing echoes from within the walls, and it summons him away from kissing his girlfriends, I guess. And so I was like, you need to- you need to help me. Help me fix it. And he's like, okay, what do you want me to do? And I'm like, fix it! And he goes, all right. Fair. And he's like, have you tried turning it off and back on again? And I did, and it didn't work. And he's like, okay, have you tried uh, generating a new a new stream key? And I was like, of course I have, Justin. That's the first thing I tried. And he goes, well, do it again. And I was like, okay, watch. I'll show you that that wasn't the problem. So I do it again, and then I hit stream, and it worked, and I'm mad about it! <laughs> Fucking... Ah! It only works for Justin. He's like, well, I don't know why you cry about having the problem fixed. And I'm like, because all I've learned about the problem is that there is no problem and that I just have to get you to touch it. That's it. That's all I learned. That's the only thing I internalized from this interaction. <laughs> why do you not believe Frankie's dad is funk? Uh, because I don't believe literally anything that the Vivre cards tell me at any point because they're almost always wrong. So how have you I'm been- sorry, that is- that is a sentence. How have you been- he been- outside of screaming at technology? Outside of- ah! I've been fine. Um, I remembered- what did you remember? Uh, I remembered a uh, cough a little a little too late in the week. Uh, cough, cough. That I have something going on tomorrow. So stream today! <laughs> so stream tonight! Ooh. Because tonight will be the night! Yeah, there's no, uh, there's no D&D &D tonight, so, um... D&D so &D tonight? Then I will fall even. for you! What? What? There's no DM. I've got DM. I do. I'm running a game tonight. <gasps> With who? Well, for a start, Boone. I do like that guy. The Boone Slayer. Yes, yes. Yes, the Slayer of Boons. Uh, we got Sword Zenny. Mm hmm, mm hmm. I do know about the funny sword, man. Very familiar. I got the, I got the Dami Mummy Mommy, Mr. Ontario mm -hmm. This is bullshit. <laughs> Uh, oh yeah, and I've got Sarah Dust. Pug! I'm so glad that, uh, your dry spell ends. Well, I had to do it my fucking self, so... Listen, I'm sorry! Man, this is bullshit. <laughs> Don't be sorry! Fix the fucking problem! I'm doing my best! <laughs> Depression Are you talking is about like you did I'm your sorry. best? What? Like you were doing your best when you got all those technical problems. You just had Shut Justin come in and help you fix it. Shut the fuck up. What's that? Uh, <laughs> don't I, don't, I don't you even fucking start, I swear to God. Side note, uh, Prophet, um, sorry. <laughs> uh, it's fine. I'm just destined to cry and be miserable and be mocked by my community for things I cannot control. You can control this. I Wait, is that like a slur for people who are shit with technology? Well, it's because of 
I can't do anything about it. It's because of my fucking EM. It's because of my fucking electromagnetic waves. Justin. Justin. I see you managed to use I iron guess. armor after four episodes. The joke's on you. Uh, not iron armor, only iron tools and iron weapons. I still have to buff my defense so I can wear iron armor. But we'll- that's part of what we're doing today. That's part of what we're gonna do tonight. Um, we're gonna- like I said before, I want to focus for a bit on expanding the base. I'm not um, making the seven serenade joke again. <laughs> I want to focus on expanding the base. Uh, and on, uh, making, and then getting us up to, to the proper defense so where we can start wearing iron armor. Oh god, what? I was minding my own fucking business, leave me the hell alone. Domain expansion. Nonical nonsense. <laughs> it do be fucking like that. I, I'm out here for five minutes! Also, hello. Hi, Aaron. Fucking leave a bitch be. Okay, I'll leave. Not you! No! Nice. Aaron! <laughs> I meant secondhand serenade. Why did I say seven, seven serenade earlier? What the fuck's wrong with me? Anyway, how's it going, Aaron? Uh, I'm, it's going. Um, released a trailer today. I have been perceived. Um. <laughs> yeah, how do you feel about that? It's been a long time. It, it has been a while for you, huh? Yeah. Well, uh, I'll good luck with get used to it. <laughs> good luck with that. Oh, uh, yeah, it's gonna be great. Uh, I had good a luck, whole... or I'm sorry about that. I don't know. I'm, it's too long. I wasn't. I'm not reading that shit. It was two minutes. It was two... <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I every love that I, meme. Every time I think of that meme, <laughs> I always remember the version of it where it's like a Twitter reply. Where it's like the Johnny Silverhand profile pic saying, sorry about that, or congratulations. I don't know, I didn't read. I don't know, I'm not reading that shit. Yeah, I feel that. <laughs> My fucking potatoes. I should get some water. My fucking pancakes. <laughs> My fucking if I, pancakes. <laughs> if I told you I never did any like theater performances or anything like that, would you believe me? No. <laughs> no. No, you're as fucking theatrical as a Hamilton fan listening to Mayday Parade. It's funny, because I haven't seen Hamilton. <laughs> God, why do you not fall under any of the stereotypes? It's really funny. I... It's one of your- it's unironically one of your funniest traits, is that you're simultaneously a bunch of stereotypes and none of them. Danica be like, damn, Aaron, are you even gay? <laughs> not. <laughs> okay, well that one- I okay, well, to be fair, going a different direction. I say, well, to be fair, I never suspected Aaron was gay, actually. So, like, <laughs> well, actually, no, like, genuinely, like, nothing in my head had ever processed the prospect of, of Aaron's not straight. We were, like, uh, we were trying to gaslight him into thinking he was queer for a bit. Sorry, what? what by the way, what direction did you think that was going in? I don't know, for some reason I thought you were going to say, yeah, Aaron, are you actually black? And I was okay, like, well, and I was about to be like, well, honestly, we don't know, so like... Okay, to be fair, that's undeniable. I don't know what the that's appropriate the thing, response to that is. Fucking is it? I don't know. We know so little about Aaron. Listen, with the amount of times Aaron Tempest has trademark stood on business, there is no other conclusion i could come to i suppose i can't like, channel black excellence without being black i don't know what to tell you <laughs> a solid point. he brings up a solid point chat that's the one thing that can't be called <laughs> you fucking yeah well we'll settle for game theory we said what the fuck was the thing we said the other day like, I asked you, I asked you, like, I think it was an AAVE question, and you didn't know the answer, and I was like, oh yeah, I forgot, and you, you said something to the effect of, like, I'm not on that particular, I'm not on that particular council. Yeah. It was just the way he said it was so fucking funny. He's like, yeah, that one I don't have any, uh, jurisdiction on, and I'm like, oh, okay. 
Didn't know that was how that worked, but you know what? I suppose. Aaron literally be like, "Yo, they let me on the they let me on the Jedi Council, but didn't give me the rank of master." Kind of, yeah. You ever uh, think you... about the fact that uh... I'm a different flavor of black person? <laughs> You've, uh, you've specked into immigrant, unfortunately, therefore you don't, uh, you don't possess the, the necessary, the necessary subcategories. I could have, um, it's just, uh, I didn't spawn in the right location, that's the thing. Ah, uh, oh yeah, Yeah, you right, got shit you're, RNG. Cause you're, that's right, cause you're Floridian. The fucking wording on all of these sentences is oh. sending me. You keep saying that, but like, you don't know. <laughs> I, you know what, I don't. Yeah, because that's like, a that's, solid. That's, that's a cogent point. That's. I'm sorry. I, I really did not think we would live in a society where we're putting Florida man in the same sentence as Aaron Tempest. No, you know what? Yeah. You're right. I think I'm fucking. I think I'm fucking stupid. Like, yeah. like, do we need to be like? I'm gonna like speak like speak from my soapbox as the Zoomer here. Do you need to be sent to an old folks home? No, you're so right. <laughs> So the uh the dementia really do be kicking in, really do be hitting different. Like so, like if you talk to like seven different people, like you would get eight different answers of where I'm from. It's also, true. also, Zenny, sword, uh, Lightsaber. funny my might... oh uh purple. Why was I going to say purple to fuck you? Uh. Kind of yes. have to have the purple one, right? <laughs> well, yeah. See, I just said purple because it goes with my outfit. I mean, I do because it's my colors. I got it. Yeah, the color purple. Uh, unironically, uh, what's it? Like, Sigma grind set rule number 573, the color purple is better than anything else. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Daedalus, if I told you if I was from any state, you would sense it. Yes. No. No, wait. Hold on. No, it's- no, I'm sorry. He's from DC because he's a fucking fed. <laughs> I don't know what- what the- the uh, what, what's- what's good, gamer? How, uh, die. Oh, there's two of them! How do uh, I make this- how do I make this uh, a group about, about the decline of DC Comics? I don't know. I'll figure it out. Um, anyway. We've joked about this repeatedly, that, uh, that Aaron is, in fact, the FBI agent that's watching our computers. Aaron, I'm sorry. I, I was about. To, what are you yeah. saying sorry for? You, he, uh, oh, Danica knows, knows. knows. She knows why. I know why. Don't worry about it. Um, but oh, I was going. Fucking to... hell, you're Danica, not pyrocynical. Calm down. <laughs> Excuse like you. I would turn. I would turn off my horny pyro mains before starting a TF2 stream. Why I'm smart. The fuck. Do they have so much? Oh God. But put no, me down, um, put me down, put me down, put me down, put me down, put me down! I, I was <gasps> gonna make- I, I just had a thought about the lightsaber question. Thank you, Zenny. <laughs> because, um, uh, I, the <sighs> thought I, I was given was, if I wanted re if I wanted to do a real NB power move, I'd just dual wheel two lightsabers, one is purple and one is yellow. True. <laughs> That's a vibe. That is a vibe. <laughs> Made that my color palette. <laughs> Nor n normalize dual wielding lightsabers got that, just got his ass. that, that oh, create your pride flag palette. Are you fucking kidding me? Yeah, oh, ironically, if it's gonna if it's gonna make the the Star Wars enjoyers cry about the Wokies, let them. Also, side note, just putting that out there, I'm holding at least one of them backwards. I think. Yes. I... Unironically, like I'm sorry, but like. It is definitely, like, I can't be alone in having it at some point in my life be my headcanon that Ventress is the very reason why so many intergalactic women can't walk on a Sunday. Do you, do you want to know a really funny thing about the books? What? Go on. So, uh, in the books, uh, when fucking, uh, oh my god, I can't think of his name. The, the cool one that Brooke and Justin like. One of the one of the other Jedi. When he he's with Obi-Wan. Yariel Poof? No, it's oh my god, he's I can see him in my brain and I can't remember what he's fucking called. But one well, one I of gone? The, No, not quite gone. It's one of the like he's he's from the Clone Wars. I Plo Koon? No. 
He's human. Kit Fisto? Not, no, he's human. No. Not Kit Fisto. I, it doesn't matter. The point is, it, it, he's with another Jedi, and, and fucking Obi-Wan looks this man dead in the eyes and goes, uh, she's going to hit on you, and you're gonna, and it's going to be hot. It'll be weird if you don't notice it. It'll be weird if you don't draw attention to how sexy she is. And he's like, are you, like, sure about that, Master? And he's like, yes. Oh, this is a loop. I'm a fool. <laughs> Bro, I'm just, I'm just mentally laughing at the image of that being Yoda. He's like, he's going to I'm be- Are sure? <laughs> She's going to be sexy. Pay attention to this, I should. She's going to be sexy, and it'll be weird if you don't make a point of noticing it. Mad the hose be. <laughs> right you were. God damn. God damn. That ass too fat. Back it up. Pull over. <laughs> 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 You can't just do that and leave. That's rude. This is yeah, that is fucking rude. What the fuck? Thank you, Steven. You Very good. You can't do this shit to me now. <laughs> Bro, you can't have shit in Detroit. Anyway. Get the fuck off of my- Get the fuck off my property! Die. <laughs> Speaking of, you can't just say things and leave. Uh, give me a fucking. No, nah, no, I get me on board. I forgot where I. Oh fuck! <sighs> get, it off, get it off! Get it off! Get it off! Oh fuck! <laughs> it do me like that. It's so funny, oh. dog. Oh right, it got. I'm fat. <laughs> 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 I forgot I... the pelicans inflict, like, a weight status on yeah, me. Yeah, I, for I forgot they inflict weight on you, too, yeah. They just make you fat, huh? They do just, they just make better. you fat. Okay, yep. maybe the reason why Danica isn't pyrocynical is because the pelicans are pyrocynical. Mom. Can I? Okay, I don't... I I always have to preface this. I don't like talking about drama, but, like, this is something I still think about. It's, like, can we acknowledge that it's weird that, like... Pyro literally looked into the camera and was like, yeah, all of that shit was true, by the way. Anyway, and then we just kind of all went, yeah, anyway. Oh, I never was. I never watched him, so. Yeah, I didn't even no. know he did that. Give me one moment. I, I need to know. Uh, I was there for that. That was. Real quick. Yeah. Um, Give me one second. I need to mute real quick to check something audio wise, but I'll be right back. Can I? Okay. But now, nah, though, because, like, no, I believe it. Because, like, that was the, like, that was a thing where it was just, um, like, it, it really wasn't the, the, the first thing I, I didn't expect the first thing I'd be hearing from, like, Colossal as crazy returning would be him reading furry roleplay DMs. <laughs> and, like, him trying not to laugh. Like. Yeah, like, I, it feels... It just feels so unbelievably odd to me how the whole community just went, eh. Oh god. Well, I mean, well, I mean when There's he was lot. standing accused of grooming a child, I I'd say him being into inflation is a little bit less bad. Well, no, that's what, but that's what I'm saying. It's like, everyone, the, the bit was, he said, like, they were like, did you groom this kid? And he went, no. And they were like, oh, and we all went, oh, cool. And then he went, I just roleplayed with them sexually. And we're like, but... Yeah, mm. But... That's, huh? that's, that, that's exactly the thing, though. That's like, the thing. But yeah, that was, <laughs> and that was, that was my point, was it was, it was weird that he proceeded to be like, no, yeah, I totally did roleplay with that child sexually. I just didn't know they were a kid at the time. And it's like, so you didn't ask? And they're like, no. And I'm like, oh, cool, Pog. Uh, I feel like you, like, it's weird that we brushed past that. Yeah. Well, let's be real. We passed over a lot of things. We, 
Mm -hmm. Die. I mean, yeah, a little bit. Leave me be. Oh no. Yeah. Yeah, like. Why you are my hits not, not connecting? Hit just huh? like you, friend. Just like you failed to pass over the subscribe button. Make sure you donate to. <laughs> Yeah, if you if you seek to Help. generate support for a good streamer Daddy. without any actual financial investment of your own, then please f feel free to use your Twitch Prime subscription. Do not forget to donate to the Starlight <laughs> Children. <laughs> yeah, exactly. We can't exactly bully children Just... if they're dead, so save the children, please. <laughs> no. The screaming, the screaming pelican attacks are sponsored by this charity. Wait. So, uh, I, I am fat. Totally Swords Any 2024 is sponsored by the children. Oh my god. What we're saying is donate to the children. Sentence. Donate to the children. That was the idea. For a good cause. <laughs> it's for a good oh. cause. Un <laughs> unlike it's the VC, so... which is a disaster. Carry on. Here. Yo, so, Zenny. So you fucking should... anyway. Yeah. What is it? Uh, I wanted to run something by uh, chat as some of the people who were here for the last stream are here. And I wanted to know if this was something y'all would be interested in. Uh, okay. Mm -hmm. So, I did a little think about what I was talking about when it came to um, uh, fucking, like, lore streams, specifically. Like, character lore streams. I did almost go to space Ooh. for a minute there. Jesus Christ. What the fuck? Uh, I was wondering if I, like, I'm gonna die. Oh no! Oh, I did it! Fuck you! Go on. Uh, Go sorry. On. I was a little. See? Ah! <laughs> Hang on. You are a little. Ah, ah, ah. I'm gonna have a heart. I died. Okay. So I was thinking. <laughs> this is the process, by the way, gang. <laughs> It's just, what were you saying? Oh, sorry, I was violently dying. Um, as you do. As is my wanton way. Um, oh, yeah, so I was thinking. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Oh, it's back again. I, I, swear, I swear to God, like, you are unironically going to, like, start to, like, inhale. And it's going to be like, sorry, you don't have right. the breathing skill. God, it sure fucking feels that way. Uh, yeah, it's kind of hard to breathe without my lungs. Like, unironically, like, in, in this mod, you will literally go to the and go for a piss, and it's just like, sorry, your bladder isn't got, hasn't got enough experience points yet. Wow, I can't believe it. It's just like looking for a job in Modern America. Damn, you're so right. Same, it ain't doing much better over here. It sucks. So fucking, uh... Ah! What I wanted to say! <laughs> before I kept being violently cut off by things murdering me! Uh, I was thinking, if I, like, assemble everything, would you guys- Would you guys be willing to do, like, dedicated streams for that? Hell yeah. Where, like, I do full-on presentations of stuff? Yeah, I'd be down for that. Hmm. I think that'd be fun. The presentations, you say? <laughs> yeah. Yes, a, hell yes. Please do lore streams. Give to me the lore. You are awesome. Thank you. I just, I was trying to think about it, and I was like, well, if I'm gonna, like, assemble all the pieces for certain stuff anyway, I might as- God damn it. Son of a bitch. Fucking- I'm gonna kill myself. <laughs> might as well die. Oh. If I'm gonna oh, assemble well. all the pieces for it, I might as well kill myself. Uh, yeah, I mean, true. Yes, but also yes. Lore stream, please. <laughs> I, I was gonna do more lore streams, but then I took an arrow to the knee. I was going to do more lore streams, then I got fucking shot in the mouth. <laughs> I just, I want to, like, I, I'm dying, basically, is the point. Like, metaphorically, <laughs> I'm, this is a great literal, re this is a great literal representation of how I feel on the inside. Where, like, I really want... I want to expand my fortress, but I keep dying at every conceivable juncture. But I keep, uh, yeah, I want to actually, like do this, but I keep getting fucking slaughtered at every end. So what I'm thinking I'll do is I'll assemble uh I'll assemble like the basic stuff. Whoops. 
uh, that I need for, like, like, that, that I would use for any other, like, video or presentation stream. Uh, and then I'll do, like, one of my PowerPoint streams, basically, is the plan. Oh my god. Oh, where is it? What? Oh. What? It's like there's a skeleton over here. <laughs> Don't worry, I got him. Here, take Yeah, the one of the one of the torches went out up here. Take this take this before he takes my eyes. There we go. Oh, that's crazy. Is that a heart shard? It is a heart Ooh. crystal shard. Nice, 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 nice. Blended. All right, you ready? Oh, there's that motherfucker. Okay. Let's jump this bitch. Oh, wait, no, it's a bow. Okay. Let's jump this bitch. I thought it was one of those weird... Oh, he shot me directly in the mouth. Oh, it is! Oh. It is! Oh, fuck. Oh, get off me. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Do you not have the right bicep lifting skill to hold a shield or something? Uh, we don't uh, have... Uh, no. no. We need we need levels for defense. What's And even on? then, that'll only give us, like, a pretty weak wooden buckler thing. Hang on, let me... A wooden buckler? Is this a economy? <laughs> I gotta make another... Oh, wait, no, no, I don't. I have another sword in my inventory. Never mind. I had, at this point, I'd take what I can get, but, like, at, at the same time, yeah, it's... I, I... Man, I miss vanilla shielding. Yeah. Don't make an experience. I have limited a... Keaton strikes me as a warlock <laughs> player in D&D. Uh, you couldn't... You literally couldn't be more incorrect. I am, in fact, a paladin, man. Yeah. Yeah, I was about to say. No, I... uh, me, on the other hand... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Aaron likes yeah, his no, Yeah, no, Aaron's... <laughs> See, I mainly... Oh, fuck. Uh... That's a... Drop it, skeleton! Mainly... Drop it! Mainly drop I... it! He didn't drop it! Mainly fuck! I just wanted sticks! Come down here and fight me like a man! Uh... Yeah. Keep... This Spriggan is literally being toxic. This is like, bullshit. Honestly, I vibe... I vibe with all the classes, really. Uh... But, like... Warlock just comes baked in with the lore, you know? <laughs> and I find that yeah. fun. I have slain Frickin you. I, I slew the, the thing that was killing you. Ah, thank you. You're welcome. Anyway, I mean... Cheap shots from Terror up above. Maybe. Fuck. Hang on. Oh my god! So I mainly uh, play bards or rogues, typically. Sci-fi Odyssey yeah. adaptation of yours, I believe it was, if that's one of the projects you have in mind for this. It sure is. I'd love to talk about it. This is... I just... Okay. This is something that I've wanted... To, okay. Gang? Okay. Is it time? I'm going to... I'm, is this lower time? Uh, a little bit. You, so I'm... Yes. I'm going... I'm going to grab you guys by the shoulders, and I'm going to be so fucking for real with you for a minute. This was something that I did a while ago and stopped doing uh, because nobody could keep on task. Mm -hmm. If we promise to behave and keep on task, I'll give you lore streams. Ooh, like... Ow, my oh. shoulder. Oh, thank goodness. No, fam, listen. Listen. Die. Uh... Oh my god! Is it the same guy? <laughs> this stupid skeleton! It's the same skeleton! It's not even to show up, it's just like... The last time I did it, like... Chat and Call kept getting like wildly distracted, and we kept going down like forever paths. And then I just never got to talk mm -hmm. about it because we'd spend 45 minutes talking about cheese or whatever. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I feel that. Yeah. And I'm like, the loves of my life, please. I'm asking you so nicely. This is my stream. Well, I mean, I didn't know I was the love of your it's life. Just like, can you... you know, now that you say it like that, you know. No it's ADHD just like, and take... only be on topic. Yeah. Can you take the ri can you take the Ritalin prescription you have normally rather than snorting it this time? Please? I was literally about to be like, listen, I don't I don't want to be all like, please take your meds before stream, but I'm begging you to take your Adderall. <laughs> Yeah, if you've been a, if you've been a, uh, if anyone listening has been diagnosed with cool guy syndrome, please take your Adderall. If you, you have to, you have to show me that you put, that you, <laughs> God, this is, I was about to say a thing and then realize that this is very much probably just a, a me experience. Um, mm -hmm. I was about to be like, if you put your fucking Adderall in the pudding, like I asked you to, then... <laughs> 
You did what to the who? So, <laughs> when I- Tapioca pudding. When I was younger, uh, one of the medications I was put on was, uh, I was put on Adderall because they thought I had ADHD. Spoilers, I don't. Uh, mm. it was the tism, but I was a girl, so they were like, well, it can't be that. Uh, oh my god. Getting done in by the doot. The dudes are killing me, dog. Um, <laughs> so yeah, um, but when yeah, you were so, a young heaton. So when I was a young heaton, uh, because I didn't like to take them because they were chalky. So they were they were the kind of pills that because they were chalky, the minute you put them on your tongue, they were like all you could taste. Mm -hmm. And I hated that. So what my grandma would do is she'd crush them and then put them into pudding cups for me, so that way I wouldn't be able to taste them. Mm. Um. That's a great idea, actually. Fuck. Yeah. She did that with a lot of medication, because I'm so fucking, uh... I'm so fucking, like, sensitive to taste and texture. So, like, that was a great way to get me to do a lot of things. Uh, also, I'm, uh, mu also, much like the weird dog that your dad didn't want, I, too, am very food-motivated. Um, <laughs> um Hedon. Same. Hedon. I'm the weird dog my dad didn't want. It's why he left. <laughs> oh. Oh no. That's really Why did good. you have too much of the dog in you? <laughs> Got that dog in her. I didn't Not get diagnosed. I don't get diagnosed with things. I don't go to doctors. <laughs> That's one way to do it, I What's guess. What's my favorite cheese? Oh god. It depends on the context. <laughs> I really Listen. I I can't lie to you and tell you you know what? Let me put it to you like this. I have what is my favorite flavor-wise, and then what is what is the preferred vehicle by which I consume it. And you're thinking, Heaton, this is the same thing. What you're saying is the same thing twice. And it's it's not. It's not and you know it. Um Because when I say my favorite vehicle for consuming cheese, I am saying what we are all thinking vis-a-vis -vis, Pizza. No. Vis-a-vis, -vis, uh, I eat fistfuls of sharp cheddar shredded cheese directly out of the bag at, uh, before I go to bed. Uh. Mm. I mean, to each their own, really. Like, hey, I just kind of have, like, the him, freaking luck. We can't pretend that we haven't all done it at least once. Oh, Look, yeah. Look, Heen, go Heen, goes, Heen goes by the handful with the shredded cheese. I just pop in slices of, like, sharp cheddar straight from the bag. You fucking savages. The funniest- <laughs> so the funniest part of this, of finding out about this, uh, this, uh, dark car- this, uh, dark passenger that I possess, was that, uh, Justin was like, well, we can get you, like, good cheese, and then we can just shred it for you, and you can eat it whenever, and I had to grab him and be like, Justin, it's not the same thing. And we can like, get you the good kush. It's a dollar store. How good, good could, could it be? be? And he, he's like, what the fuck do you mean it's not the same thing? And I'm like, it's not the same thing. This is like, this is, reminds me of like, like the whole, this is not the same thing sort of sentiment with like consumable products. That's a weird way to put it. I know, but, um, listen, man, sometimes it's just not the same goddamn thing. I don't know what to tell you. We yeah, no, I, I, I'm, like, reminded of the one time back when I lived with my folks when I entrusted my grandmother to get my energy drink supply instead of my mom, and I learned to never do that again. I need high because farming her, because nobody else in this goddamn because her, will do it. Because her ass bought Red Bull, and I was like, ma'am, I'm not in the what market the to- What the fuck? Uh, uh, what the hell? Yo, he feeling kind of silly. I was- doing We're doing a little <laughs> silly mode! We're being a little silly, being a little goofy, doing a little We're doing trolling. We're clowning. We're doing a little bit of clowning. Little bit funny. I sprained my knee. Googly eyes? Being a little silly, little goofy, little wacky. So anyway, I was gonna make a joke about how Red Bull tastes like this, but I lost my train. Red Bull of does taste like this. Yeah, yeah no, I, I tried it once uh, from like a workplace. It just, meh. I like don't I, understand it. If I ever did the energy drink tier list, Red Bull is the one of the only two that goes in F tier right next to fucking Prime. What the fuck is? Oh. 
Oh I'm no, yeah, lie. Prime sucks. Oh, hello? Yeah, Prime Prime is a fashion statement for nine year olds. Look, if if your drink can be can be described with any level of viscosity, that is a hard pass. I don't I'm, even know what that word means. I'm I'm so sorry. I I I saw a sleep paralysis demon in my brain reset. What the fuck was that? <laughs> I went down there, I was like, what the fuck are you? It turned around, saw me, screamed, and disappeared. <laughs> that makes sense. Are you Man, sure our own craft doesn't have horror mods? Man, turning, screaming, and then disappearing, that's what my dad did to me! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so your dad is Heaton's sleep paralysis demon? I'd believe it. Sounds about right. I've been, I believe that. I've been told the tales, I would believe that. <laughs> I was gonna say, I think Heaton's heard enough stories about, about my fuck-ass dad to know. <laughs> Oh, there's a chupacabra. Where? Upstairs. One of these. Uh, one of these. Up here. Are, leave it. One of these. One of these days, make you fun of him. Uh, I don't think it will leave us. He's not coming down here. You sure? Yeah. You won't. Never mind. Nope. You know what? I was. Oh, I was. He's wrong. coming down. He's coming down. <laughs> I've never been so wrong about anything in my life, Zenny. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry that yeah, I. You better stay up there. What's that? Stupid. I don't. Stupid. Yeah, I'm run not away. Let you get, let the, you get the chance. chance. <laughs> Yeah! Oh my god! Not his ass. What the fuck was that? Oh fuck, what is that? Oh, it's a trumpet. Wasn't that, like, a fucking 6 9 clip or something? Nope, it was, a, I... it was just a normal ass skeleton who shot me directly in the face. Okay, cool. Very, oh. very good. B based, uh, based in real killed, um, honestly, of him. Side note, James, I plan to try a Lucazade at some point. I just haven't. Because I'm an American. They're harder to come by over here. Why is that zombie looking like he's trying to bust it down? Please no. Oh, fucking, uh... Wait. Hang on. Yeah, before, so I found that skeleton. Before you go back down, let's go to sleep. Yeah, yeah. Good idea. Uh, eep time. Eep time. Uh, I'm eep. I was gonna say, listen, for my, for my lovely UK viewers, aka, uh, Lynn and or James, <laughs> uh, if you wish it's me specific. <laughs> oh, you'll you'll know why in a second. Um, if you so desire to leave tribute at the altar of your favorite eyeball-based god, I will accept more crunchies, please. <laughs> Just more meet crunchies? Heaton at the altar. I was. What do you mean more crunchies? I was given the candy bar, the crunchy. Oh, cr Nestle Crunch. No. Uh. No, the good stuff. The good stuff. Uh, you're the... saying Nestle Crunch isn't the good stuff? No, no these I'm are better. Good. They're, um... Oh my god. Fucking Christ oh, shit. These? Yeah. Give them to yeah, me. Yeah, they're, they're not uh, my I'm, thing, I'm... but I see why people like them. I like them. I like honeycomb. It's really good. Sorry. Oh yeah, honeycomb. They're honeycomb Shoot, chocolates. Sorry. I like them. I can't look at it right, right now. I'm fighting also, against the Tarioku. There's also Tarioku. the fact that, quite frankly, I'm sorry, Americans, but our chocolate is literally just better than yours. No, factually true. <laughs> You're I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna fight you on that one, Lynn. You're just right. European chocolate I want, is just better. I are want to be a hundred. In our food, it's not. Those aren't ingredients. Those are chemical combinations. Those are chemical I want yeah. to be a hundred with you, real quick. If your vision gets foggy, just hang out. It's just a cousin. He's minding his own business. You mind yours. I want to be so for real for a minute. Go on. I had oh, like asking. I haven't had I oh. haven't had British chocolate before, so I can't weigh in on that conversation. It's really good. Unironically, oh, I I need to do like a thing where we get everybody like in our circle over here, and I go I show you Americans what weather spoons is like. I'd love to so... go to the UK. Oh, don't worry. I've... I plan to visit oh, the UK. I plan to visit the UK solely These because Help. yes, they are. Help. It'd be the, it'd oh, be the easiest like, vacation like, to get my grandma a gift oh, from. Oh. Yeah, like so. You know what? You, uh, at the end of the day, is it less prestigious? Yes, but uh, VidCon UK exists. Does it like? Is it anywhere near as good? Probably not. But it's an excuse. It's true. Mm -hmm. I'd love to go to the UK again. I had a great time when I went last time. It's one of those for it's one of those foreign countries that I want to visit at some point. I'll never especially fucking, because 
I'll never and quite frankly, if you're going to, like, if, uh, quite frankly, you are going to need a local there to say, hey, I know they're an American, but they're one of the good ones. Factually <laughs> true, because I had one when I went. Uh, a fucking long-term friend of mine, we went to visit her when we went, and we were like, you need to take us to the... We were like, where's good places to go? And my grandma listed off a couple of places, and she had to grab her and be like, these are tourist traps, don't fucking take her here, they're overpriced and they suck. Uh, but I, I will never forget one of my favorite memories of my UK trip with my grandmother, who has now since passed, um, was... There was a moment where we were like, we're gonna... Oh my god, it's just a bat. Oh, that scared the living <laughs> shit out of me. Uh, god, this game's made me so twitchy. No, no, I get you. Um... But, uh... We were, uh... We were going into... Oh god. It was a department store. It's the... I don't know if you'll know what I mean when I say this, Lynn, but the... It's the... the big... the big fancy one. The uh, big fancy department store, that's not specific enough. Yeah, it was... I remember part of it was that we had to... we were dress coded? It was... We were dress coded? Yeah, it Where was, the fuck did you go, Eton College? It was in... <laughs> I remember it was in London. Um, and we were told that we couldn't wear, well, like, they didn't literally stop us, but our English friend said, oh, oh god, oh, wait a minute, I was just, oh, I was just gonna light that box on fire, but alright, uh, mm -hmm. our, in my English friend, who we went there to see, uh, told us, if you wear, like, if you wear cargo shorts, or, um, <laughs> uh, you. If you wear like cargo shorts or like <clears throat> sandals inside, they like won't talk to you because they'll think you're just tourists. Well, that's just anywhere in the UK, really, because nobody likes tourists anyway. It was not. So, I, like, remember, that's not figured. I remember it was. Uh. Oh, Brits don't like tourists, huh? Was it? Yeah, we do. No one really likes tourists, to be Interesting. honest. Well, we're not tourists when we go to other countries. When we go to other countries, we intend to keep it. True. <laughs> oh, uh, fucking Herod's. That's where we went. That's the name of the place. I'm sorry, I'm not over the... I'm not over the <laughs> specifics of this story. Oh, uh, God. Yes, the sandals cargo shorts combo of the average tourist. Mm -hmm. I don't know. If... Surprise. It was wild. It was really cool. I liked it. Well, yeah. Sorry, what? I'm just looking them up and they're fucking they're selling sunglasses that cost 365 quid. Yeah, you unironically could have just gone to Boris's house. <laughs> yeah. It was really great. We got uh we got a really good array of candies there. Candies not Candy's not in your mouth. Damn it, you both beat um, my shit. But, but like, but also, <laughs> I remember, um... I remember, uh, something we were told was going to happen, and I thought that she was kidding, but we were not. Uh, the best... We, we of course, had to get, like, real fish and chips while we were there. The worst ones... We, right, you do. The worst ones we had were at a fancy restaurant. The best ones we had were in a fucking hole in the wall across the street from the Sherlock Holmes museum. Yes! Yes! <laughs> that is it. Unironically, because um, fish and chips to the UK is what microtransactions are to EA Sports. Our economy would be nothing without them. It's. I mean, it already <laughs> is, arguably, but you know, like, unironically, fish and chips is the single biggest, like, staple of the working class. Yeah, it's it's one of those things that like we were like, I bet that it's not gonna be bad at the nice restaurant, but it's it's gonna have been better. They were gross at the nice. Yeah, restaurant. exactly. Cause like, cause like, I'm sorry, but if you go to a fancy restaurant and you order fish and chips, you're literally like those Americans who got stuck in like mud in like mud storms because you wanted to cosplay being poor. 
Yeah, it was ridiculous. Oh, we're like, that's this... a thing? Oh, yeah. Yeah, because like there was this like there was this like get together or something. Oh fuck this! I'm gonna go back and, to mining rocks. Uh, some rich people decided to pretend to be poor, but there was a mud storm there, so they got fucked. Heh, <laughs> bitch. Oh, that's what they get for trying to cosplay the working class. Exactly. <laughs> you can wear Fucking... you can wear our skin, but you'll never have our experience, bitch. Exactly, <laughs> unironically. Yeah, it's like they ruined thrift stores, so I have no mercy for them. Yeah, exactly. Like, the only, like, I'm pretty sure their nose would, like, combust internally if they set foot in a Primark. I don't even know what that is. I can't Primark... go to a Primark. I can't be seen with the pores. Yeah, Primark is clothes for poor people, basically. Uh, okay. Which is bullshit, because there's just, like, nice stuff. I love Primark. no. Like, That's say, fucking I love... right. Primark's great. I love being around you guys because I get to learn new fucking words that I don't know. It's crazy. I'm gonna, I'm yeah, same. So real with you. I have such a problem with current fashion right now. It sucks. However, okay. Karma, Listen, dog. I am, I am a guy, so. <laughs> yeah. yeah same. Oh, oh, you yeah, no, have I get problems you. <laughs> with modern fashion. I see. Oh, me now. <laughs> no, I'm saying that like, that's like I'm saying like in terms of like when it comes to like modern fashion. Like I've seen what the clothing line is for some was like for dudes, and I'm like, okay, which is like which JRPG are you auditioning for, fella? <laughs> <laughs> when you say that, like that's not cool as hell. I the, watched. No, I'm not a standard. No, I'm talking. I'm talking. It's like, I'm talking. Uh, Final Fantasy Tactics Two JRPG to protagonist, not the cool ones. Ah, <laughs> uh, so you don't mean? Ah, uh, wait, hold on. Wait a minute. There are people in this world that don't wake up every morning deciding they're going to try and look like a Nomura designed character. No, let, let, you, no hold on. I, let me get you the exact. No, and I, I figure I, I'm figuring out what you're trying to say. I'm just shocked because I'm like, if you're going to ape the like the drip of like JRPG pro tags, take some take shit from Nomura's book. He he drips the fuck out of all of his characters. Like, come on. Fair enough. Why do you think I wear four belts? With like half of my outfits now, like come on. Oh my god, what the fuck is in my Because hand? you have, because you have issues with your parents. <gasps> Stop me excuse me, excuse you, me. I love my fucking mom. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> no, it's just my dad. I have issues with. Don't worry. <laughs> Understandable. Have a nice day. Uh, the daddy issues are why I'm a whore. It has nothing to do with my fashion. Sense. Um. Um. Oh fuck. Yes, Eden. I was gonna say something. I completely forgot. I'm sorry. No, it's not your fault. I was I was literally like, oh, Danica, I've got something to add to, to what Danica is saying. I'll, I'll wait till she's done, and then you finish. And I was like, nope. No, you didn't. And my gonna... brain went, no, the fuck you don't. <laughs> now, now I'm curious. What were you going to say? <laughs> fuck. Well, it oh. means brain remembers. <laughs> yeah, I'll let, I'll let you know if I fuck. Oh, no. Remember. Oh, fuck. Now I, Damn, now I know why there yeah. was a boat in the middle of the Dang. water. Because, like... I'm very glad that previously, well. <laughs> I'm very glad that I'm too poor to, like, try it, but, like, I'm very glad to know that, like, fucking uh, rich people eating fish and chips, they get fecal matter, because at the end of the day, if you, especially if you're a tourist and you want the UK experience, if you you do need fish and chips, that is government mandated. However, it needs to be served by some local guy who's been like working there for forty five years for next to nothing. His face is like covered in sweat. He's like fifty years old. Oh, the other we were talking about this too was, uh, we went we went to the British Museum uh, our last day. Because my grandmother and I were, uh, we, we liked, uh, Egyptology, and God knows. Uh, so, we were, uh, so we were there, and early in the morning, we wanted to have, uh, lunch, and there was a group group of uh, lovely Greek gentlemen selling euros, and we were like, "Hey, you guys, open? That sounds delicious." And they were like, "No, we are not. Not for several hours more." But and like in a in a moment that you would never see in the United States, these men went, "But 
Uh, there's a great breakfast spot inside the museum. Their food's really good. We highly recommend it. So you don't- so you shouldn't have to wait. And we were like, oh! Thank you! Hmm. How convenient. Yeah, how convenient. Over here, people are polite. Yeah, as opposed to the US, where they'll be like, no, we're not open for another, like, 45 minutes. And because they want- yeah. Well, because they want your sale. So they'll be like, no, we no, we don't serve breakfast at 10.02. Here's my AK. Mm. Yeah, ha, ha, Cox Dog, you found that's me. so informal. Can you at least, like, have some class if you're bringing your fucking hand firearms to breakfast? Like, at least bring, like, a fancier weapon. <laughs> When, like I dog. You, when I tell you that I was raised in the kind of area where you could, in fact, see men in their 40s open carrying uh, handguns on their fucking hip inside of a breakfast joint. And I have see, seen exactly that. See, but that, at least, see, that's, a, that's, just that's, a, fucking... that's classy. Notice how he's how they're open carrying their handgun. You know, very classy, very... Very, very mindful, together. very demure. Very demure. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes. I was, I was about to make the comparison to fucking. Uh, what was it? Um, I was about to make the connection to, um, Mike Herman Trout from Breaking Bad, and yeah, he is very mindful and very demure. I'm gonna, I'm gonna fucking screw. <laughs> building blocks. Okay. I like oh, these though. They're you. pretty. I will. Use I them. am building blocks and shit. Shit, cause I'm, I'm in fucking fuck Minecraft. Minecraft. <laughs> I'll take your word for it. I'm gonna use uh -huh. those in my build. I like them quite a bit. They're very pretty. Can't say I'm not too much of a gun person myself. Uh, as somebody who is trained to use them, uh, they're kind of cool. I like. Uh, I'm I'm sorry, the idea of Heaton holding a gun is like- that's like the one American where it doesn't compute. <laughs> I- no, just, Oh, like, if, if you want your mind- What do you think the Eldritch Black is? What's the Eldritch Blast is just- The Eldritch Blast- bullet. Yeah, I was about to say, the Eldritch Blast is Kitchen Gun. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, I love you, like Kitchen Gun! I love you, Kitchen Gun! <laughs> bang, 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 what? bang! And Side it note. sparkles like new! I love the kitchen gun skit. Because, like... Him. Because, like... Uh, Wait, hold on, I gotta... I'll go to the to... US and I'll get a tattoo of kitchen gun. Because, like, um... <laughs> I said this earlier, um... My grandma loves the UK. So because of that, I had a steady intake of their pop culture over the course of my adolescence. It's why I'm the one American who understands it when a European makes an in-betweeners joke. Um. My, uh, my father was, a uh, My father was a, was a gamer. Uh, was stationed in, uh, the UK for a good chunk of his military service. So he taught me, uh, a bunch of the, the lore, as it were. <laughs> the lore. <laughs> Being requested, oh. British. British. Yeah, because that's it. You guys the like food. spend. You guys spend like, he like so much money on your military that you can't afford to feed your homeless people, and yet you still have to get us to train yours. Okay, Google, yeah. set a timer for two minutes. Bro, listen, I'm gonna be so real with you. The reason why the bill, why we spend so much on everything and yet nothing gets done is because in America, the best way to make money is to be a middleman. You don't make money by actually doing something or making a product. You make money by getting in between the product and their client. It's actually Those... true. It's one of the most fucking mm. irritating things about, uh, like, modern American um, business is that, like, well, it's, it's one of the things I fucking hate about the medical system as well. Is that every time I need to do something, I need to contact like fourteen different motherfucking people for just like yeah. one. Different. Well, yeah. Everyone's just... on different and coverage because you have insurance. Each insurance has their own specific little areas, which are like non competes, but they're legal for some reason. Which is ridiculous when you sit down and think about it. It's it's fucking absolutely deranged. And the the thing about it that drives me absolutely up the fucking wall is that like. You can't, like, nothing's fucking easy. You know what I mean? Like, it feels like, at least, like, 
part of it should be easy, you know? <coughs> like, there should be a part of it that's, like, not horrifically complicated. But it is. It, it always is. Everything is. Because everything's a because you're right, because right, like, everybody has to be a middleman. There has to be, <coughs> like, ten, like, ten degrees of separation between, like, between you and fucking breathing. Yeah. And, like, okay, two things, right? First of all, yeah, because at the end of the day, this is why, uh, like, pro-capitalist people are dead wrong when they're just like, oh, capitalism's a great system because it forces people to make things that people need. And it's just like, it would if the most profitable business model wouldn't just be to skim money off the top of everyone else's shit. Okay, Google, stop. Okay, and second of all, Heaton, what voice was that? <laughs> My English accent? It's the, the go Fair enough. It's the one I go to, anyway. Unironically, you should, um, we should, like, uh... Unironically, when you, uh, get over here, we'll go to Weatherspoons and we'll see what, um... Just order a pint with that voice and see how long it takes for them to realize. <laughs> I've thought about it! Like, I, it would be really hilarious if I went to Britain and see if I could trick them into thinking I'm British, because apparently I did it with one! <laughs> God, it's so mm -hmm. fucking funny. In the fucking, uh, in the old, uh, Senate, somebody was like, is Aaron British? Oh, okay, Google. What? Set a timer for two minutes. But now, nah, though, because, like, in order to do that, though, you've got to, you've got to, like, fall asleep on the plane listening to Danny G. Who's Danny G? Who's Danny G? Have yeah. you not seen the have you not seen the the clip of him going, um, I live in Smethic Birmingham and you wanna fucking brawl? Come down Smethic Birmingham, uh... ask for Danny G, I'll come out my house and I'll break your fucking legs, you little bitch. <laughs> I've anyway. I think I've seen that clip, but I've I've never heard of that guy before. Are you are you logging off for the night, Zenny? Yeah, I gotta head out for a D D sesh. I did manage to fix up that fishing rod in one of the chests though. Hell yeah, thank you. Yeah, see ya. See ya. I wish him good I... rolls tonight. But yeah, cause like, uh, cause like that, there was that, and like when that meme was like blowing up, he got like absolutely inundated on his Xbox Live profile with like people just bombarding him with messages constantly. So he made a YouTube channel. <laughs> yeah, as you do. You know what? Yeah. I, that's kind of based, honestly. Yeah, and like, and he was, and then because of that, we now, we then got a clip of him going, I just woke up in a fucking Stevie mood, yeah? Because I live in a shithole. Shit there we go. It's a fucking shithole. Shit I hate the fucking the bloody place. Face. It's full it's of full dick, it It's fuck, I fucking hate it. And it's just like, mate. I... I love that this man is everything right with my country. I will forever I remember oh, when someone when someone perfectly reanimated that audio, but it was Hobie from Across the Spider Verse. Now I need like, I need that I on, need let, that. Let, let me get it. Let me get it for Give you. Give it now. I like hold on. This. I like the color, the texture change. Fuck yeah. Okay, Google, stop. Because like that's the uh, because like that because unironically that's the 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 two the two cornerstones of my country are Hobie Brown and Danny G. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least you got that going for you. You are asked uh, if you ooh. are Brummy or a Brummy by someone in my chat. Someone, that's James. <laughs> Listen, I don't want to. I don't want to put him up if that's gonna get his ass beat. I don't know what that means. I think it just means someone who lives in Birmingham. God, Hobie is great, honestly. Agreed. I'm so glad more people like my favorite spider person who isn't Peter or Miles. It's just he's. Just fantastic. He's there. We go. He's absolute perfection. Our first extended inner wall game. Oh game. hell yeah! Look at that. Look at that liminal space there. You could put so many 
caretaker so the songs in the background while staring at that wall. So, our, <laughs> like I said, our goal is to just expand the base a little bit. So I want to I wanna do this much, like, around the whole thing, so that way we have more, like, um, hang on, I'm actually gonna, because there's so much space. Uh, let me, more stone bricks. Uh, what the fuck are them cracked stone bricks? There we go. I want texture. Texture. And then. Oh god. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Deep boop. Oh no. Oh, I forgot that these are- oh, well, no, I can just- Yeah, I can just- up, up. Yeah, I can just- Slab. There we go. So yeah, like, what is it that- God, what would you guys need to- Need to do here? Like- I wanted to go to um, uh, Shakespeare's hometown, but we didn't get the chance. It's an option. That is an option. Uh... Oh, we also uh, we had a good like conversation about whether or not we wanted to go to uh, the place where the Reichenbach fall in the Sherlock show took place. Valid. Because, uh, some phases last too long. Sweats. What do you mean? Don't worry about it. Some of us made mistakes as teenage girls, and some of us, uh, learned to grow out of it, you know? It's fine. Uh, I need gates. No, okay. Too. Be great. I need... I'm gonna nod and smile. The people who know, know, and that's all that matters. I see. G, ruminating from Tilly. I see. There's I no see. organization in these chests, and it drives me nuts. But we don't really have a lot of options right now. Uh, I need to make another flint and steel. I'm gonna go back down there. Uh, boop. Unfortunately for me, part of the best way for me to get XP as of the current. Is the sun setting? It is. I'm not going out while the sun's setting. Fuck that noise. One of the best ways for me to get uh, XP is while I'm expanding the base. And I do have some rough textural details I'd like to change about the house before we, uh... I don't know how much time I have to improve our living situation, or how far we'll get, really, chat, but I want... If we're gonna do this and it's gonna be hard, I wanna... I wanna make it a little livable, and I wanna fucking do one of my favorite things to do in Minecraft, which is build. Fair enough. Building is good. So why to uh, learn how to do the funny uh, redstone engineering? To the surprise of absolutely no one. No, that seems like something you'd like. Yeah, Aaron's out here just making like a full computer that runs Windows 7 or some shit. Yeah, it would be Windows 7. I hate current 
Windows and stuff, man. I was, I was about to say, yeah, Windows 7 was like the last one that I heard people actually liked. Yeah. Like... Shifted my weight, that hurt. My poor ankle. <sighs> What if it's raining? But I need dirt to expand the farm. Realm! Hello, hello there, Realm Wars fans. That was a... You squeaked oh. so loud that Discord didn't make you audible for oh, any God. of that. Hi, Realm fans. The monkey is here. Monkey? Monkey. Um. Oh, I'm gonna show you a cool thing. I don't know if you patch this out, but if you're thirsty and it's raining, you can just look up and just drink rainwater. No, you can't. That's sound. crazy. <laughs> um, Why don't I think of that? Hello there, my lovely legionnaires. I am Heaton Mitsuru, your friendly Eldritch Abomination VTuber. I'm a variety streamer. I do many things. I draw. I play video games. And right now, we're in the middle of a series of charity streams for uh, the fucking Starlight Children's Foundation. We're trying to raise money to help uh, children who are currently in the hospital get certain amenities like nicer clothes uh, and more, uh, more comfortable beds to sleep in so that way they can make their treatment a little bit easier. Ended. This is the second year that they've asked me to partner with them, and I'm so glad! I love- I love partnering with this organization. It's very good shit. Well, I can't sleep! Reject Modern Advances, Return to Monkey. Donkey Kong. I cannot return to slumber. There are children that need to be fundraised. <laughs> There are children who need money, and I am here to help them acquire that money. Oh. Oh. oh god. What if the water was sludgy and radioactive? Then I probably wouldn't be able to drink it, could I? Or never changes. It just gets stupider. As it tends to do. That really is it. Like, yeah, Fallout was wrong. War does change, but it only becomes more silly. Uh, silly isn't the word I'd use, personally. But I get the sentiment. I mean, there is another one I'd go for, but I don't know if it's allowed on Twitch. Uh, you know what? That is so true, Bestie. Is the word that begins in G and ends in I'd allowed on Twitch? <laughs> Uh, I don't know if it is or if it isn't, so I'd, I'd err on the side of probably not. Fair enough, didn't think so, to uh, be honest. Cool. cool. Thanks, video game. <laughs> Thank you, Minecraft, very cool. Got all the way up there, did all of that jumping, and then he just fucking punches me in the mouth. Alright, cool. Now, based, honestly, whatever. What the fuck was I thinking? No, I'm stupid. How could I have ever thought... Oh, I guess I should. Oh, come on. Why didn't that work? I don't have any string. Otherwise, I would. Hi, Realm! Hello, Heaton. Sorry about the Crypt Keeper. It's kind of a dick. No, it is it is the way that it is, I guess. I'm destined to be beaten to a pulp and die, I suppose. <laughs> By the Crypt Keeper specifically? Uh, you know what? In this video game, distinctly possible. <laughs> I should... Like, you will prevail against every other foe, but once the Crypt Keeper comes, nah, that's a counterpick. I'm guessing I... Yep. That's what I thought. Oh no, oh no. I... Yeah. Sorry. I was working on a monkey. A monkey? Yep. With a big stick. <laughs> oh yeah, you said you were working on Wukong artwork. Yep. And yeah, I'll be continuing my playthrough of uh, Black Myth uh, this weekend. Nice. Good shit. Yeah, I, I was also breaking down the uh, ending cutscene to the third chapter because uh, when I initially streamed the game, we all got the lesson to that story wrong. <laughs> oh? 
Yeah, but we we failed our media literacy. <laughs> Good job. Yeah, but no, like after like learning like what the story behind it actually was, I think so far it's my favorite cutscene in the entire game. <laughs> nice. Because initially we thought the whole lesson was that oh, it's a lesson about how greed is awful and greed is to human nature, but no. No, it was actually much deeper than that. Don't you love that you, shit? I love when the video game is smarter than I am. Yeah, because uh, cause the one thing that really stuck out to me, because like at the end when... uh, Because one thing I will warn, like if people want to look up the cutscene, uh, it gets messy. Oh. Like it, it, gets, it gets very messy, very gory. You know, I've been, I need to actually, when it's affordable, find the time to play Black Myth Wukong, because... Like, I know my my sister's probably to the moon about it because Sun Wukong is one of her favorite characters ever. Oh, yeah, it's a just really like, fun game. Just like that, that just like in general, she just loves whenever Sun Wukong is adapted. Yeah, I'll say that it, it's very much a diet Dark Souls. Like, it's not necessarily like a Souls like specifically. It, it just simply borrows some mechanics from it. Well, but like, it's nowhere near as brutal. I mean, to be fair, those are usually the best souls lights so that's just a letter of recommendation to me because i'm gonna be so real if you as good as proper souls likes are uh they're uh for lack of better words they're uh non from soft like relatives tend to appeal to me more yeah like i like like bloodborne is really good uh mm -hmm. and elden ring is Too definitely short. good for the people that like it um but I, I tend to gravitate more towards the uh, souls likes that aren't made by FromSoft. Like, <laughs> like it's like fall. you you don't you don't mind games that challenge you, but not ones that just kick you in the dick every five seconds. Like, <laughs> like because when I think of like my personal favorites in the Soulsborne genre, I think of stuff like the fall like Fallen Order, or I really like the demo of Stellar Blade when I played oh, yeah. that. I need to actually buy that game too, so I know. Um, I don't know why Bruh. I thought you were going to say. Then it could be like. What did you? Then it could be. Hold on, what? No, no, hold on, Eden. What did you think I was going to say? No, it's gone. Never mind. Are you kidding me? <laughs> then it could be like. I'm so stupid. Sorry. You're not stupid. I just want to know what you're. I just want to know what you're thinking, and I can't do that if you keep forgetting everything. My brain's yeah. so smooth. I'm sorry. Develop a wrinkle. Stop using the iron on your brain. I won! Bruh. <laughs> then I could literally be like, you play from software, I play from soft titties, we are not the same. <laughs> yeah, but like, uh, yeah, to go I back to like, I mean, I uh, can't. yeah, but uh, to go back to that one cutscene though, like, so after like, uh, this one big turtle man just gets ripped apart for all like, uh, the treasure and miracle cures that are like inside of him that he's been giving to these people and just feeding into their desperation. Uh, you then get the moment where, like, there's this monk that walks up to his riddled corpse and he just goes, once again, I proved it to you. And the most important line is the guy's, is the monk's response to the guy being, you chose a means to an end, not to a proof. You sow, you sowed chaos into their hearts for the sake of winning. How absurd and pathetic. Also, I would like I'm to correct, I would like to correct Jez's post in the chat vocally in the event they don't see my text and then say i didn't like elden ring i just said it's good it's great for the people who like it yeah that di that is not me saying i did not like it that is me simply saying that i am clearly not the person who loves the game the way a lot of its fans do it's why i say stuff like that it's like it's, it's, gr it's great for the people it's for i can't even trust <laughs> jazz post of all due respect i am openly queer on the internet i i, I do i have no fear. <laughs> Emo says, can I eat Play-Doh? There's homemade Play-Doh that's edible that you can eat. So, is this what we're doing now? <laughs> he didn't <laughs> deny you batteries long enough, you're devolving to Play-Doh then. Is that what's happening? Bruh, these fucking pathetic, like, not, not like middle grounders. What's the word I'm looking for? Centrists? Huh? Centrists? Centrists, yes, that's it. But now it's these, like a... These, these, or, or as Class of 09 would put it, fence-sitting liberals. Yeah. Hmm. Side note, I lost my mind. 
Eh, you'll get it back. Yeah. Um, I'm so, listen, I'm so glad that, you know, uh, admitting that you have a problem is the first step on the road to recovery. No, no, I, because I, I, like, I didn't even tell you why I lost my mind yet. <laughs> I don't know, I'm assuming it was for something silly. Um, yeah. would you qualify, sure. would you qualify Lotus Juice officially being on the Friday Night Funkin' soundtrack as something silly? Yes and no. Because it's true. Uh, they not. I don't know. I don't know who that is. Uh, Lotus Juice is the rapper and all the Persona music. Ah, I've, slain you. If you... I've slain you. You're dead. What the fuck is okay. this now? Danica, if you told me anything was in Friday Night Funkin', I believe you at this point. Yeah, but I mean, like, officially. Like, uh, it is yeah. going to be in the official final yeah. product. Yeah. Father yeah. Tempest is in oh, Friday Night Funkin'. Hold Dude, up. could you imagine? <laughs> Go the fuck away. <sighs> that would be fun. Uh, would, I was checking something, fun. bitch. Is that a crab? Uh, I <sighs> just... So I just have to learn how to make music, I guess, in order to make that real. All right, looks like it's just... <gasps> oh, yeah. Oh, wait, no, I don't. It's just a, lot of Friday night mod... <laughs> a lot of Friday Night Funkin' mods don't have good music. I'm... <laughs> mm. <sighs> oh well. All I know is I'm not using AI for it. <laughs> By the way, side note, I'm unrelated. But, um... I'm gonna be so real with y'all, chat. The Coca-Cola Oreos are kind of mediocre. They're not worth it. Dang. See, I've heard that the uh, Oreo Coca-Colas are really good. I mean, I'm sure they are to if it's your thing, and I'm not even saying they're bad. I just was, I guess, I was expecting more. That's fair. Like, they feel more like it feels more like Coke, like Oreo rocks than it does Oreo Coca Cola to me. Maybe that's just because I was expecting a stronger Coca Cola taste. More Coke. Maybe my expect. Maybe maybe I'm like the average. Maybe I'm like the average Shonen fan, and my expectations were unnaturally high. I don't know. Um, I thought you would have been. I want. Uh, maybe I'm just an average shonen fan where I'm high on coke. I mean, that's I mean, true. I was gonna say, have you seen some of the stuff Dragon Ball fans say on Twitter? I believe they're high on coke too. Um, I love. Somebody said. Somebody finally fucking said it, and I'm so glad that somebody finally had the fucking nuts, because uh, but somebody on TikTok brought up. They're like JJK fans. Do you you motherfuckers have a problem with object permanence? Because like, uh, fucking Hakari is not on screen. Your daddy is not on screen for uh more than like, uh, for more than two chapters. And they're like, "Where's Hakari? Where the fuck is Hakari doing? Where the fuck is Hakari?" And we're like, the, "His fucking job." It feels like that. It kind of feels like that. Um, Simpsons bit where it's all like. When Homer's like, when Poochie's not on screen, the audience should be asking, where's, where's Poochie? Poochie? Yeah, <laughs> it's so, it's so fucking irritating to listen to these motherfuckers uh, sit here and be like, where the fuck is Hikari? I can't fucking believe it. Like, and they're like, you motherfuckers have no reading comprehension because it's a recurring theme where like if somebody doesn't say something explicitly to camera they're like i don't know they didn't explain it that's fucking stupid i don't fucking know what's going on i can't fucking keep up with this bullshit anymore and i'm like dog i'm i'm literally on my knees begging you to read the fucking book in your hands why are grown ass man read why are the book. why are video game tutorials so handholdy now me looking at the way people engage with shonen manga man i can't i can't pin it why creatives would think they have to spell everything out to you now i can't it's, imagine it. you, you want to know what's really sad though about the whole why are people making games this way anymore because i was actually looking at a i was actually looking at a documentary video where someone was pinpointing exactly like at this one conference is like see this is the like this is the reason why we're designing our games this way and they show a clip from dark, dark side, side fail. fail yeah they show dsp like not knowing what the fuck he's doing at any given second <laughs> just bumble fucking around and i'm and i'm like i can't fucking believe this this fucking sucks Can you i believe hate it, it here 
Can, can you guys believe how much DSP has impacted the game developing industry? You know Man, what? I, wonder, I can, unfucking. I wonder if he, I wonder if, he, if the camera was on the whole time. <laughs> I fucking wish. No, you Did have I to. Already, no, I know. To, no, I know. You have to. No, as I say, because like I didn't remember what he said during that incident. But my sister tweeted the quote with no context, and I checked the replies, and it was like light touching the death note. <laughs> it's so fucking funny. <laughs> like, oh, the camera's out. Like, they are, in fact, literal infants, where it's like, where's Hikari? Where's Urame? <laughs> Jingling the keys like it's nobody's oh, fucking wrong. business. There they are. Literally, I hate children. Rollicking start. So, um, Starlight Children's Foundation. Well, uh, yeah, Justin I'm Norman. aware. I, I'm aware that I can't, that I'm autistically not reading the room. I'm very sorry, uh, but like, I'm sorry. I, I just <laughs> because this is a JJK conversation, my brain just instantly pictured that being like, like a skit where Megami says that, and then Yuji has to turn to the camera and go. So anyway, the Starlight Children's, Children's Foundation. Foundation. <laughs> <laughs> so, 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 so uh, we're holding a charity event for the Starlight Children's Foundation. By the way, fuck the kids. I fucking hate it's, kids. Uh, anyway. It's, it's like, I'm sorry. Oh, no. me Megami reads to me like someone who would literally be easily annoyed by small children. Yeah. Also, like, actually, true. Ironically, just Chad, brings, I hope you're clipping this. <laughs> brings one of the children on stage to do the presentation about how great the charity is. And then as soon as the, as soon as the presentation's done, we just punt them off a cliff. <laughs> uh, so you hate children yeah but like because like i i have like a sneaking suspicion that like so much of why like so much of why modern fandoms have the iq of a celery is because most of them are children it's true i the the thing right i've i've ta I talked about this at length uh in one of my more recent yap sessions is like it's because there's no like there's no safe i, I don't want to use this word but i can't think of another one there's no safe like segregated area for children so like the because like adults want to just be wherever they are you know they don't want to read the room and be responsible for the kids around them, so they just kind of take up space. And we keep having this goddamn problem. But there's no, Damn. like, safe third spaces for kids. I gotta get out of here before I get heat stroke. Yeah, like, because, like, rest in peace, uh, Club Penguin. I was gonna say, on the early True. internet, it was, like, early to, like, on the early days of the internet, and even, like, the mid era of the internet, like, there were plenty of sites and places just kind of built with the idea of being used by children mm -hmm. and like so little of them exist now that like fandom space areas that usually would would and frankly should be reserved for like people who are older have been like invaded by like 13 year olds with a lack of with a lack of literacy for a text so like and and we could go on a greater conversation i'm sure you have by the I, way i haven't will yeah, I'm sure you have before, and I'm sure we have, the two of us, have had this conversation once before about how... Some permutation of it, at least. Now we we see, like, kids entering fandom spaces that they either shouldn't be in or aren't, or spaces that aren't, well, that they aren't welcome in, and et cetera, et cetera. And it's like, it's kind of why fandom is in such a state that it's in now. I'd argue it's also why social media is in a state that it's in now, but that's a whole different conversation, and this is heat and strength. Um, so I'll save that for, uh, my own soapbox. He didn't yeah, want to get in, you want to get in yours? Uh, yeah, I just, I want... Yeah, yeah, the box is on the ground, step on it, please. Thank you. Uh, I, th the thing with me as far as I, as far as my shit with this goes, is, like, I, I feel like we've just hit a juncture where, like, Everybody's in everybody else's spaces all the goddamn time, you know what I mean? Like, there's no, um, there's no third space for, for kids, there's no, like, proper extra area for adults. And, like, the thing of it is, right, a lot of people, 
like to quote that fucking uh and like not unjustifiably so that fucking uh comic of the like what are you doing you shouldn't be in adult spaces this is the sophia the first fandom like like yeah fair no like that's that's totally a fair and valid thing to feel and to to be like that's not what the fuck are you talking about but like i've never seen what you're talking about but it's hilarious carry on uh but like i feel like I feel like there should be places where adults and children can share the same, like, interest. But, like, they do need to be moderated and treated uh, a little differently than, like, we currently do. You know what I mean? No, I know what you mean. Like, it's just not... The way that we go about these things as of right now are not responsible. Yeah. It's true. I love... Uh, this is one of my favorite bits. Is that... Um, that fucking let's go gambling! Let's go gambling! Gambling, gambling! That's all I ever hear from you anymore! I hate gambling! Ah, oh, dang it. Ah, oh, dang it. <laughs> I was about to say, yeah, this feels like there might be bigger problems at play here than children. Well, yeah, no, it's yeah. a multi-layer. It's a multi-layered issue, which is it's why... It's a very multi-layered issue. It's one of those conversations that I primarily only have with Heaton, because I've learned very quickly Heaton is one of those people I can trust with complex topics where I can state an opinion and there's not a 50-50 risk of her misinterpreting everything I'm fucking saying. This is a compliment, by the way. Intentionally or otherwise. Oh, like this, this is this is quite literally me complimenting your conversational skills, Ethan. I want to make that clear. Yeah. I appreciate Hello, it. Hello, I'm back. Yeah. Like I, I still, I still distinctly remember the conversation we had about the whole like how you were tired of this modern era of media critique that just boiled down to th the thing you like. You have to acknowledge, yada yada. I, 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 that's been a you have to, yeah, God, you have to acknowledge that the thing you like bad. I'm just fucking stupid. I hate that shit. I talked, I, that's why I made that fucking video is I'm like, I'm so tired of this. Like, oh, I have no, to agree. Like, like, yeah. All right. I will acknowledge that some, that some things I like aren't as good as some of the other things I like. And now I'm going to go back to enjoying them. You're smelly and stupid and I hate you. Yeah, unironically, like, I don't care, like, if it doesn't, like, fit your sensibilities of, like, a piece of media needing to be, like, needing to be Fallout New Vegas level perfect in order for it to be even remotely acceptable to you. What gets but, me? Oh, finish your thought, sorry. Yeah, but at the end of the day... I had fun playing Cyberpunk, and I don't care if um, these NPCs act like if these NPCs are making the exact same joke about how like oh the 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 glitches nah, because they never actually played the game they just watched Moist Critical play it at launch. Mm -hmm. I, I, and... I need I need you to understand, Linlin, as a fan of of games developed by Ukes, and by that I mean a particular franchise developed by Ukes, I know how to appreciate art that has a little jank to it. And yeah, like, exactly. The jank is funny. Yeah, and like, it's... And it's just like, I'm sorry, but like, at the end of the day, when I'm enjoying a piece of media, I'm enjoying a piece of media because I enjoy it. I'm not enjoying it because, oh yes, I feel so very intelligent, and I like how this makes me feel smart to watch this. I mean, there's, there's some things, right, that, like, that I do watch for that exact purpose, is like, oh, yeah, I like that. Yeah. But, like, but I'm also not under the delusion that that's not why I'm enjoying the thing. You know what I mean? Like I'm not. Yeah, pretending, exactly. Like, like, I'm not gonna pretend that's why I like. That's not why I like the thing. Because yeah. like you see these people with, with like that little emotional intelligence, where they're just like, oh yes, I, I enjoy X piece of media because of all of the deep philosophical things that it says about our society. No, you like it because of the big titties and the guns. See, I'm multifaceted. I like it for everything. Yeah, at least, well, <laughs> like, I. I was able to deeply analyze 
a game that most see for as exclusively fan service and notice that it was a love letter to an entire medium with 50 plus years worth of of history behind its back yeah. so i like my whole point with this topic and why i like what he didn't said way back when in the forever times is that i feel like too many people have like this tunnel vision view of like how to engage with certain pieces of art versus others. Meanwhile, I'll look at everything with the same lens and try to see what I get out of it by the end. And even if I end up maybe not liking it, I still try to acknowledge, you know, maybe maybe it's not bad. Maybe it's just not my thing, you know, yeah. fig figure out the difference between something being bad and something being just not for me. Like, this is my go-to example. And I'm very sorry for people who've had to hear me use this example three times already this week. I'm very sorry. Um, I'm apologizing because I don't know how much of our audience is in, it, it, it like crosses over even. Um, but like, Final Fantasy VII is a good game. Final Fantasy VII Remake is a good game. Okay. Seven Remake is not a game I enjoy. But it's a good game. I don't know how to explain it, but that's how I feel. Who the fuck was it like forever ago? Who was the, who was the fucking countdowner? who made that video and that was the whole somebody's whole counterpoint was like well you're acknowledging that it's i don't remember man i don't I, know but that's just sounds... like, oh, like or it's just like oh you must acknowledge the fact that your favorite piece of media is bad in places and it's just like yeah the same way that i have to acknowledge your mom when i'm banging her yesterday no there was it was somebody who specifically said exactly those words who was like i understand fucking musha commentated on them i think uh, it was... Desolator Magic? Maybe? What 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 was it? Because, like, the sound's familiar, but it's... The, co the, it, the, the commentary at play was literally just, like... I remember there was a point where he said... The guy that was being commentated on said, like... Uh... It's a good- it's a good game, it's a good quality product. But it's not for me. I don't like it. I don't understand it. Yeah. And that's the a... retort was Well, if you can understand it, then this is a bad argument because you're that's... just admitting that your taste is bad. That's not what was being said. Like like I'm not I'm arguing with the person you're clearly disagreeing with, by the way. It was nuts. I was I think he was commentating on Nihilistic Snake at the time, which is a hell of a name. Yeah. <laughs> That's a uh, name I haven't heard in many years. Me the too. Point, the if point it wasn't being, for the fact that it oh would get God. me demonetized immediately. Like, <laughs> like, yo, Granny, you gonna tell us the story about Classic Sonic and the war? Uh, like, I'm, I'm just, I, I genuinely just think. It's okay to acknowledge when something is, you know, you know, you wreck it. You can re like being able to recognize that something is good. You just, it's just not for you to your, it, yeah. Like, and I feel like the fact that a lot of people just aren't capable of doing that is why we have so many thing is secretly garbage seven hour essays that flood my YouTube recommended. It's like, no, if people that's... could just acknowledge that things are, can be good and still not vibe with them as a individual media enjoyer, we'd be in a better place, like, in terms of media critique, but... If people I, didn't just take someone else's media media critique format without understanding why it's done the way it is, we would be in a much better place. However, comma, that's neither here or there. Watch uh, my trailer. Anyway... Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, unfortunately, we are just a part of, like, we are just, a, uh, just surrounded by people who just take things of fiction more seriously than they should that they put it over like the existence of other people it's like oh well, you see i would feel bad about the position that you're in but you have this bad opinion about jjk i don't agree with so i hope you live in poverty yeah so, like you, like people just... people talk, people talk about like real situations like they're fictional and fictional stuff like it's real again they get mad at you if, if you don't recognize the difference Yep. Yeah, exactly. Like, you see, like, you see so many people out there, like, treating, like, online conflict as if it's a fucking Netflix show, and it's just like, mate, these are real people here. These are their stories. And it's, yeah, and it's just like, I'm sorry that, like, it, it, it's very easy to forget that because you never have to interact with them personally, but, like, 
the the people you walk past on the street and never see again that's still a person and like if you think that they're in any way less entitled to the same respect that any decent person is entitled to just because they don't like your danganronpa persona your danganronpa like persona then like like my notes yeah, basically. I, I mean, like, I was gonna go off about how, like, so much of this is because at the end of the day, people, when they watch a media critique or whatever, they're watching it because at the end of the day, the modern YouTube audience watches things because they want a YouTuber to do the thinking for them. God, you're so right. Yeah, it is half the problem. Though I do, I do think that a lot of the time, right, People don't actually, like, make these takes or whatever to actually engage with the product critically, you feel me? It's like, it's it's a, it's almost like a performative dance kind of sort of thing. Yeah. Because, like, for instance, right? Like, I love Metabots half to death, right? Mm -hmm. And even what? when we're talking... Hmm? Poop party! <laughs> I... How does... <laughs> okay. Who's taking a dookie on heat and stream? Fellas, fellas, you ever try and have like a nuanced conversation with your chat about, uh, about <laughs> Bro, media like... consumption and like the way that the broader internet is and then just poop party? <laughs> Bro, you're actually just over, like, at the UN talking to them about how you've, like, fixed the problem with There's... world hunger, and then fucking, uh, I don't know, like, uh, I don't know, like, then Heaton's just, like, oh my God. you just hear someone just queef they're in giving the back me the, of the room. They're giving me the plague! Whoa. Oh, oh my God, oh my God. Sense. That's disgusting. The monkeys have given me have given me plague. Oh no, not the monkeys! Brother, literally just uh, uh, got who 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 looked at Minecraft and they were just like, you know what, this is missing cholera. <laughs> I there's they're all over. Die, I guess. I don't. What did I get? I got cocoa beans and shit. <laughs> Listen, when they say eat shit, they don't mean literally. Wow. Anyway. I don't. Oh boy, what the heck was I talking about? I, d uh, I don't yeah, remember. Media consumption. Media consumption. Yeah, so like, yeah, oh, you gotta acknowledge everything, like, problematic about your series or whatever. Uh, first and foremost, uh, they don't actually do that. Because, like, some of that requires, like, critical thinking and be like, oh, actually, that's, in retrospect, that's kind of not a cool thing, you know? Uh, but again, that requires critical thinking, which is something that these guys don't like doing. <laughs> Yeah, they need to wait for CinemaSins to do it for them. That's not even, like, critical thinking, because, like, half of the time, right? Okay, you point out nitpicks in a film, you, like, oh, like, people, it's people trying to be, like, like, smarter than their, pro, than the media, but not in, like, that, that actually requires, like, actual, like, like, thinking to do so. Like, of course you can know, like, oh yeah, alright, so you, you notice if, like, a frame angle isn't consistent in, like, two shag in like two shots okay I... that's that's one problem i guess but like then basically be like oh uh clearly like it's like uh this character said x but they're suddenly doing y that's totally not the most optimal way to go through the story so it's bad like like sometimes like it's the like like refusing to just uh, to suspend your disbelief it's so also like not understanding fundamentally that sometimes like in real life 
uh, people say things and then do other things for reasons that are uh, more complex than a narrative. Yeah. I need, like, do we have string in this motherfucking base at some point? We have to. Yeah. And even then, like, I don't even have a problem with, like, hour long, like, reviews or whatever. As long as they are yapping about something that matters. Like, yeah, okay, cool. You think N is Vosh. Um, that's not critical thinking. That's... I'm sorry, who said that? Who do you think? <laughs> I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Oh, there was Lily. <laughs> I'm breaking that's Lily Orchard's legs. Like, dude, like, dude, I I was watching, like, bits and pieces of, of her retrospective on Pokemon. It's not a retrospective. That's a clickbait title. Um, listen, full disclaimer, I haven't played, like, a lot of the main series Pokemon games because I'm not made of money. <laughs> um, Understandable. But, like, I literally... In high school, I made a PowerPoint presentation that was a more suitable retrospective of like the first set, the first seven generations than Lily's than Lily's six hour. Well, oh, come on, mate! You, your PowerPoint presentations, yeah, that, that's very fair competition. <laughs> very fair, very fair. This one wasn't even like one that I really put that much effort into. Okay, now it just sounds like I'm flexing. <laughs> I was about to say, no. I love that you're like trying to be humble and actively making it worse. Because <sighs> like it was um, it was for it was at, it was for visualization uh certi certification. Uh, I got it. Uh. I, it's like, I am PowerPoint certified. <laughs> <laughs> no, listen, it's okay. It's Lily Orchard. You're allowed to flex. Well, yes, but like that, the the point isn't in, in, the point wasn't to flex. The point was to basically be like a brief overview of like the mechanics is like the bare minimum. But Lily doesn't even do that. I don't even yeah. think Lily f even mentions the special physical split at any point in the video. <laughs> Which is like, you should well, sure. no, they're probably also telling you that uh, shiny hunting's a waste of time. If you want a shiny, just hack it in. Like, bro, I don't listen. I don't even care about shinies all that much. <laughs> like, I, I, I genuinely, because like so many of them are just bad. <laughs> like, okay, what's the difference? Oh yeah, the, the shiny Pikachu was like a slightly different hue. <laughs> it's hey, true. Aaron, would you like this shiny Goldango when you're trying times? Uh, I don't know what that looks like. <laughs> All I know is, um, it can't be worse than the Italian restaurant. <laughs> oh, it is. It is. It, in fact, I think it's the worst shiny. In fact, shiny Garchops look at this and say, I want apologies. Die, I want easy, easy. I can't for five, for five minutes. Oh, d I just want to mind no. gravel in peace. Wait a minute. <laughs> no, no, Daedalus. Are oh, you kidding don't, me? Don't get me started on that oh well, yeah i'm gonna do a completely cool i hate it here bro that what yeah that shiny gold dango no it's not <laughs> <laughs> so definitively no it's not <laughs> corporate would like to for you to determine the differences between these two pictures they're the same picture, same picture. picture. <laughs> yeah like at that point this is why I don't like shinies. <laughs> <laughs> like, if, like, like, uh, like, Lily's point about shinies is, is stupid. Um, yeah, like, yeah, nobody will care if you hack the shiny in, but, like... Got you. Got your ass. The whole point is the journey. Yeah, like, the whole point... Sorry, you go. Yeah, it's like the funny Slayer song, Life is a Journey, Not at the Destination. If you hack... <laughs> Like, I've been there. I I had an action replay in my youth. I had all the shinies in the world. They don't- they didn't mean anything! <laughs> I, yeah, I actually right. remember make- I actually remember making a post that's like, Ah yes, no one will care that I'll- that I have an entire team of hack shinies. Wait, what do you mean I can't enter worlds? No, for, nah, man. Verlissify would like to know your location. <laughs> oh, he would. He would. Yeah, he would like to report- he would like to know your location and then hand it into the Gestapo. Listen, I I'll throw down at the streets. 
in real life. Look, I'm just saying. Like, I believe I'm... that. I'll walk the dog. I don't. I don't. Oh. <laughs> the fact that the fact that Villasify was going to have a boxing match with Shofu, but it didn't happen, will forever depress me. Oh, dude, not not surprising. Dude's a coward. Literally, dude used the mass shooting to get out of a contest once. Well, yeah, what? exactly. Yeah, because he was like, um, because like as a replacement for that boxing match, he was just like, yeah, well, money match in Smash Ultimate, right? Yeah. And like then he, um, then he pussied out of that and said one of the reasons for him not doing a money match, which mind you wasn't at any sort, of, like it wasn't specified to be an in-person thing or what. He said that his reasons for cancelling the money match outright was because he didn't want to go out to an event because of a Jacksonville word I don't think you can say on Twitch. Yeah. And it's just like, mate, playing online exists. Oh, dude, like, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Sniper Wolf wasn't the only person to completely ghost a kid requesting their, their presence when they were dying of cancer. <laughs> know any of this holy fucking oh i never yeah. told you yeah, yeah but there was this there was this like child who was like a fan of felicify and he was just like he was like out here dying of cancer and he was just like yo verlis want a battle and he was like nah because of course well you never know like i if i personally was so confident to basically say here guys this is how the you you build a gengar physical attack uh, I don't know why you wouldn't be taking matches all the time, man. <laughs> yeah. I was like... talking about this on my stream! <laughs> <laughs> Mate, I'm sorry. Fury Cut of Venusaur is simply too good, and you're simply too bad of a player to realize it. Have you considered- <laughs> have you considered, Aaron, that you're just stupid? Uh, no. Uh, hi, I'm back. <laughs> sorry. I didn't say anything before BRBing. I said it in Omega. I just didn't want to interrupt the point Len was making at the time. I, I needed to do that. There's, there's something so profoundly funny about... Have you considered that you're stupid? No! Have you, have Why? You, okay. I can't explain it to you, but that feels like a conversation Yugi and Joey would have had during the original Duel Monsters. <laughs> have you ever considered that you're stupid? No. no. <laughs> I had not considered this. Uh, Have you... No, that is that is not the shiny. That is not a shiny, James. Um, that is a different form. That is east side. No, I think that's west side. Yeah. So, uh, Gastrodon has two forms. Yeah. Both of them have shinies. <laughs> they do. But nah, like we just get the we just get the fucking. I hate the fact that I'm able to quote Tokyo Ghoul for this shit. Where guys, I didn't. Like... I love that. Somebody in chat. Guys, I didn't try hard. I could do better. Shows like a fucking cinematic fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> it's no, true. It's okay. okay, James. Aaron's like, I could have. Aaron's like watching the footage back and he's like, I could have done better. And we're like, motherfucker, this is the first form of the Virgil fight. What are you talking about? This is the first Gabriel fight. Wait, I did? <laughs> this is the. I like that you don't know. I like that you I... couldn't parse whether or not this is a bit. I'm pretty sure it is because, like,. I know my limits. I don't play first person shooters. Oh my god. He doesn't play like chat. I, I really would love to see Aaron play Overwatch. I'm, I would rather I'm sorry. die. <laughs> sorry, this topic of Ultra Kill got brought up. And now I'm remembering that one KH2 ROM hack being worked on that lets you play as Roxas that's adding a style meter. Oh, fair, I love cool. I love the the way you said that. I'd rather die. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, that's the natural reaction to asking someone to play Overwatch in the current year. It's yeah. true. That's, uh, unironically, POV, uh, it's just like POV, your friend asks you to play Overwatch with them, and it's just a picture of a smoker's like, lungs. Like, I would rather play Valorant at this point. Well, of course you would. It's got hot women in it. Hey, guys, I always love playing the, the Cole Cassidy's. <laughs> Oh, sorry. No, correction. Of course you'd rather play Valorant. You're a degenerate. <laughs> Good lord. Um, what did I get? Where was I? Oh, yes. Uh, <gasps> I was supposed Hello? to talk about the... Yeah. <gasps> hey! Iron. Nice. Ooh, what Iron the... Katana. And oh, an Iron good. Saber! Oh, I got good swords! I got apples! I got fucking oak saplings! Damn! Swords. Oh, Finally. 
Ah, uh, yes, my Daedalus. Shit, yeah. Daedalus. I will now speak about the Ralts as a starter. Um, yeah, there's something so wickedly profound about somebody being like, Hey guys, I want to make a video, a six hour video, about a retrospective of a Pokemon, of the Pokemon series. Make sure to see if it stands the test of time. Now, uh, allow me to complain about the difficulty of the game while hacking in a Pokemon that you weren't supposed to have, weren't designed to have, and is objectively a terrible pick for a starter. <laughs> no, what are you talking about? Because I don't know if... Hello, chat. Competitive, this is like semi-competitive Pokemon player here. Ralts' defenses suck. <laughs> you are... <laughs> they do. And I'm not just... only that, not only that, it, at level 5, Ralts Snowball! only has one Thank move. Thank you for the $15 to support the Starlight Children's Foundation. Yeah, yeah it has yeah. one move, Growl, which doesn't do damage. Which doesn't. <laughs> And it has 40 usages. So you can't even, like, struggle your way to victory. Say what they're called, Aaron. Huh? Say what is it, Cox Gun? Say what it's called, Aaron. What, growl? No, no not say, usages. Not usages. Say what it's called. <laughs> Use the technical term, Pokemon Use player. Use the correct term. I'm using layman's terms for a reason, fellas. <laughs> <laughs> say it, say the term. Say I the refuse. letters, say the letters, Aaron! Well, fine. Fine, it has 40p squared. Moving oh! on! Oh! <laughs> oh! oh! Damn it. God, is that... I, I can't, know, honestly, I can't even be mad, he got me, he got my ass. I, I'm sorry, <laughs> that's, that is the best thing to call it in the bedroom now, your p squared. This is my p squared? <laughs> That is so good. Unironically, like before you, before you like consummate your marriage, you're just like, yeah, that was a great day. Okay, now enter the P squared. Aaron Tempest, everyone. <laughs> Alright, what voice, James? More Sal. Okay. Okay, Google. Set a timer for two minutes. By the way, side that note. Voice? Um. Uh, I, I think it's like a one of the voices Heaton does when playing Ace Attorney. Ace Attorney. Where, it's one of my yeah. Ace Attorney voices. This is one. Ow. Yeah. I was the just one... I was just talking by the way to Brooke here this morning, and she said she thought it was really funny. Uh, how popular the Sal voice was. <laughs> she's like I'm I don't. She's like what I'm about to say is gonna sound mean, and I'm like rollicking start. <laughs> And she says, I just didn't expect that people would keep asking you to do it. And I'm like, I didn't either, honestly, but I'm kind of here for it. It's really funny. Sorry, it just sounds like you're about to say that you've been with your waifu, Princess Peach, for three years. Oh, My waifu, yeah. Princess Peach, and I have been very happily married for the last two years. That is per like, that is perfect. Uh, allow me to specify why uh, hacking in your waifu Pokemon is a bad idea. Um... <laughs> No, Erin, you don't understand. I love her, and I want to I want to stick my dick in her so bad. Oh yeah, I I read the webcomic. I know. <laughs> I just I just I it's just like yeah, I bet you do. I just want to. F <laughs> I can't even I can't even make the joke I was gonna make. I formulated the sentence in my brain and was like, that's fucking disgusting. <laughs> I couldn't even do it as a bit. Don't my worry. Fucking, my fucking water and lava can spawn. What the fuck? Don't because don't you left it exposed to air, so it's just froze. Oh my don't fucking worry. god! I think you're right, actually. Oh my fucking god! Shit. Uh, yeah, so it's Ellie. Really Hello, fun. Ellie. Hi, Hello. hi, Ellie and Chad. Um. I want to put my lightsaber in her Snorlax pit. I fucking hate that sentence. That's fucking disgusting. Go to jail, Unironically, bitch. I feel like I've just been harassed. Okay, Google. Like oh, wow. I'm getting. Okay, I'm Google. Getting the, stop. I'm None getting the are... same kind of feeling as I got that time when I got catcalled in the street. None <laughs> of you. None of you. None of you are giving off the vibe of a country red rock with a handbag, and it's disturbing. I thought you were about to say, say none of you will see the light of God, and you know what? You're right. Okay, uh, I'm the. Okay, well, for starters. I'm the last fucking person to say any that to anyone. Let's get I that was out of the way. I about to say. <laughs> like, on. if anyone in this room's not seeing God's light, it's 
fucking me. I'm going straight to the Hasbin Hotel when I die. Let me tell you that. But, like, uh, out that aside, uh, that aside. Got you. Got your um, ass. Have, are any of you familiar with Cunty Regirock with a handbag? Oh, uh, I'm intimately familiar with Cunty Regirock with a handbag because it's incredibly funny. Okay, good. <laughs> that's you want like, what? I'm calling the police. That's one of the only free things I know about Pokemon because I still need to play a. I need to finish a good Pokemon game. Oh, yeah, we yeah we did discuss that. Yeah. Uh, anyway, back to back to my TED Talk. Um, okay, Google, so, set a timer for two minutes. So, Ralph's stats, um, I will I will read them off to you. I don't know uh, why I thought for a split second my brain did not process that you said Ralph's stats, and I thought you just said Realm's stats, and I was about to be like, yes, Aaron, tell us the stats spread on Realm Wars. Y yes, please. I, I want to know what my stats are. I don't read them. They're irrelevant. They're just they're <laughs> infinite when they're up against the Charizard, though. It's true. It's true. Very true. Factually true. I've seen it. I, I need... I want Realm to know that I can't look at that fucking lizard without going, oh yeah, that's the lizard that Realm was once fucking dead. <laughs> I think mean, he's, he's done his job. I have. Uh... Like I, I mentally cannot look at Charizard about picturing... Realm Wars RKOing that motherfucking lizard. I mean, that's what I've been doing at Pokemon Go. I saw a Jibber that's like, hold on, I can't go back yet. I need to, I need to do work. I have to show, I have to show him how it goes. <laughs> Golem throw rock at it. Literally, yeah. just me when like there was this like uh, this thing I saw on Twitter of this like comedian's comedy sketch where they were just like. Um, being a child is when you have a crush on Charizard. Being an adult is when you realize that you don't need, you don't want to love a Charizard. You want to love a Dragonite. <laughs> Factually, no. You know what? Factually true. Yeah. Yeah. Love a real like, dragon. Yeah, like not. It's not just like it, it's just because like the the way they set it up, right? Where they were just like, you can tell that. You can tell that, like, Charizard goes to the gym every single day because they're a self-conscious loser. But Dragonite just, like, eats junk food and is cuddly in bed and is just great. I need to- I need, I need at some point to get the- to get waystones. I, no, I need, um, death totems is what I fucking need. What the fuck is killing me? Oh, there's a Gru. Oh god, die. Oh my There's god. a Gru? Yeah, that's what they are called. Can't believe fucking... you're being killed by Despicable Me. I know, every day of my oh, the frail of the double Cause like, I this, have... like, this no, shit really. is killing me. It's not, in and of itself, it is not the dying that pisses me off. It's the fact that every time I die, I then have to go all the way back, all the way back down the fucking, all the way back down my mine shaft. Because, like, I don't lose anything when I die, but I keep fucking, it keeps, like, quadrupling the time, and this is fucking annoying. Uh, fair enough. It's about the, it's the one thing that's still frustrating about this. <laughs> okay, yeah, I, I almost spoke before I thought about it, and you know what? I'm not gonna go there. Yeah, I will your, say. My mind shift. Yeah, I'm mining, say. Ellie. Yeah, I will say, uh, Dragonite it can, at least can learn uh, Dragon Dance and buy a level up. Uh, Charizard needs a TM. Anyway. <laughs> I'm going to fucking shoot myself in the next 30 seconds if I swear to god another creature comes up to me while I'm trying to mine oh, yeah. the skull. I swear to fucking god. Oh my god, there's another one. Fucking... Never said me. Meanwhile, Aaron, and meanwhile, Garchomp is like, y'all get Dragon Dance? Dude. Kill yourself. <laughs> Turn the ball on yourself. Wait, Die. Garchomp doesn't get Dragon Dance? No, no. You would think. You would think. I'm sorry, I'm calling bullshit on that. <laughs> no. You would be I'm fact what checking you right now. Go ahead. I am fact it's checking you right now. It's not even the dumbest thing. It's not even the dumbest, dumbest thing, right? It, Lin actively even. out here being Pokemon snobs. Anyway, uh, speaking of which, I was supposed to read numbers. I was supposed yeah, to. Yeah, oh yeah, read this, uh, read us the, the stats spread. So for Ralph, Oh my god, son of bitch! <laughs> <laughs> son of bitch! <laughs> nobody, absolutely nobody. The heavy sister, the moment there's a minor inconvenience. I fucking, I fucking hate, oh my god, I fucking hate the Geonax! Fuck these goddamn things! I am trying to just, I am trying to just go down in the fucking coal mines! This is ridiculous! Shouldn't have to do this every fucking day! This is absolutely insane! I will be right back. Okay. Again. Yeah. 
I hate this so, goddamn thing. Fucking die. I stand corrected. I genuinely thought I remembered using a Garchomp with Dragon Dance at some point. Mm -hmm. nope. No, turns out you are but simply full. Did you submit? No, I guess so. I thought I did. I guess not. I will now stop. <laughs> yeah, I. I, I, I number. Yeah, read number. <laughs> yeah, so for routes, HP. 28, attack 25, defense 25, special attack 45, special defense 35, speed 40. Oh my god. Um, I will now read Kerala's, uh, it's uh, the mid-stage evolution's stats. HP 38, attack 35, defense 35, special attack 65, special defense 55, speed 50. Now I'm going to read Piplup's base stats. Spread. I was about to say, now give us the now give us the starter base with that spread. Piplup, HP, 53, attack, 51, defense, uh, 53, special attack, 61, special defense, 56, speed, 40. Damn, nearly double. Yeah. All because they didn't want to use TC Nick 3. I have returned. It's not even TC Day Free. I could pull up anyone and would have a more balanced sp like spreadsheet. You are effectively playing as a glass cannon, and you only develop the cannon part, like, arguably when it evolves into a Kerlia. And it's... even then, that speed ain't gonna be doing you much. <laughs> yeah, when it's a Ralt, you're a, you're a glass cannon shooting blanks. Basically, like, heavens above. <laughs> <laughs> and you don't even have you don't even get like access to an attacking move for like hold on let me, let me see the move spread actually oh oh at least at least now he gets disarming voice at level one that's cute um, uh to answer your question big mac no i have not but that sounds fucking horrible oh my god all right gen 4 gen 4 it was no, god it's not gen 4 yeah, it learns confusion at level six. Okay. Uh, James is asking if you set the timer. I. That's why I was like, I don't think I did, so I will but simply stop. Yeah. That's two hours, and I'm getting frustrated. So I think that's where we'll call her. Let's see. Where do we? Where are we sending you? Ba, 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 ba. Who's who's up? Oh, I'll send you to. Uh, I'll send you to Yuki. Hey! Support the nerd. Uh, so there won't be a stream tomorrow. Today was supposed to be tomorrow's stream, but I'm doing a thing tomorrow, so I can't. Uh, I'll see all of you uh, Tuesday. A day less uh, one day I will tell you about the comic, but not today. Not <laughs> that day is not today. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. I was gonna say something. I forgot. Ah! I'm sorry. My brain isn't smooth and whatever. Goodbye. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>